Hi there Aries, thank you for joining me for your weekly forecast for week commencing the 23rd of November. With the Sun and Mercury having relocated into your sister fire sign of Sagittarius, on the face of it, and ordinarily at this time of year, you would open up the throttle and embrace a more expansive and independent type of approach. Your free spirit would certainly give you the opportunity to enjoy the pre-festive celebrations. But this year is going to be different and rarely have I seen a week which will be so influenced by the planet Saturn. Now Saturn has justifiably got quite a reputation and it's asking you this week to be very careful about what you think and what you say. Choosing your words with consideration and also your strategies is going to help you to do very well. But you can't scatter your energies too thinly. You really need to focus on what's precisely important. This is because Mercury is going to be combining with Saturn all through this week. If there's any gaps in your knowledge, this would be a great time to actually add to your skill set by learning something new. This can also give you an enriched sense of self-value. But Saturn is also in an opposition with the full moon which occurs on Wednesday, suggesting if you blurt something out without thinking it through, or you want to change something just because change is appealing to you due to some kind of inner restlessness, that won't work either. But Saturn does forge a fantastic angle to your ruler Mars. And if you interact with people in the right kind of way, with balance, you're able to listen, as well as assert your own ideas and exchange them between you, some very good relationships can build up from this. I think perhaps the most tricky of all the aspects this week, however, is the square that's coming from Neptune towards the Sun and Mercury and, of course, Saturn. This is really quite testing in the sense that any kind of psychological stuff that's in the background of your motivation may actually come out in ways which you find yourself hard to understand. So this would be a good time to think a bit more deeply about anything you don't quite understand about your own attitudes or feelings, even if that does mean stepping back at times and having a few reflective moments. It's been a real pleasure being with you. Thank you for joining me. Good luck and goodbye for now.